I think that meeting like what we have here, it's not the type of meeting you can have virtual. It is not because the vast majority of, you know, of the people that comes here are a part of a family. They are working with us. And, you know, we, we interact, you know, during the lunch, we interact during the cocktail hours. And, and I think that's something you cannot do virtually. This year, I wanted to do a smaller meeting, but I didn't want it to be too uh, overwhelming in a way. So I am trying to invite the people that I think really move the needle in the orthopedics field. And another thing that I saw um, is we saw very young, young people now. Some people they didn't get their PhD yet. That's another aspect of for future meeting is to try to bring people that are not as established, but people that have great ideas, you know, and often they have the enthusiasm, they have their fire in their belly, and I think that's great to bring this to the meeting as well. And also when I invite people, I want them to talk about how can we apply this to the patient today? Is there a pathway to do this? Sometime as a scientist, you know, I think that I can move the needle and I can do everything on my own and I can talk to the patient and prescribe drugs and everything, but it doesn't work that way. All the regulation in doing research and doing basic science research versus clinical research is two different ballgame. And I love the clinical research. I love the basic science, but I love the clinical application of what we do. And, and that is really, you know, the direction that I want to go in the future with the meeting.